Hello everyone, my name is Dilip. You are watching the Data Labs. In this video, we will learn about how to uh, sum the values using checkbox control. So, uh, here you can see that in demo worksheet, uh, there is a table which contains select like, zone, uh, zone wise uh, purchase sales and revenue data. And uh, some checkbox are available against each and every zone. So, uh, here we have provided the access to user so that user can check and uncheck. Uh, the required uh, row like uh, zone and basis on the check and uncheck uh, the grand total will show the result so show the summation of uh, values so uh, this type of uh, feature will help you uh, help you and your uh, like your audience as well uh, to uh, deselect or select uh, uh, values basis on their requirement so it's very easy let's move to exercise worksheet and uh, prepare this uh, 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 control box uh, checkbox and use, use them in summation of purchase sales and revenue let's move it so we i have already replicated this uh, the table that is journal uh, purchase sales and revenue so what we need to do we need to insert checkbox control so you can find checkbox controls uh, over here like in developer tab and inform controls if you are not able to see the developer tabs uh, in your excel then just go to file and then option and in customize ribbon like check uh, the developer tab once you will uh, uh, check then click on ok and now you will be able to see the developer tab in your uh, uh, in your excel like right? so once you will see then go to the developer tab then insert and the checkbox okay so just uh, like click on here and just double click and remove all the uh, text available like checkbox 5 and whatever and again uh, check and make it a little bit smaller right and just uh, put it against east so zoom okay and again uh, copy it and just paste it again just paste it for uh, north south and uh, west as well so we have already uh, pasted uh, the checkbox let's uh, you can align uh, the checkbox if uh, there is some like disalignment so here it's showing perfectly so what we need to do we need to connect all the checkbox uh, with the cell so to link the uh, checkbox with the cell either we can uh, create uh, like click on right click and format control and uh, cell link you can provide the link over here a5 for it or you can directly like select this and go to formula tab uh, formula uh, and uh, formula bar and uh, this is and uh, just give the reference again the click and just uh, give the reference of a7 okay and just click and give the reference of a8 now we have linked all those uh, uh, checkbox with the uh, with the sales like uh, that is that is connected with a5 and it's like let's put so once you will uh, check this then it will start showing the true once unchecked then it will show uh, false same goes for each and every text uh, checkbox now we have done uh, in the checkbox part so we need to apply uh, uh, the formula here so we will use some if function over here so some if uh, okay and the range the range should be uh, this one okay and just uh, free this range and uh, the criteria should be true so we have to sum the value only if uh, checkbox has been checked otherwise uh, not okay and the sum range will be this per change okay Let's and press ctrl r to replicate the same for sales and revenue now we have done uh, with the calculation let's check this so now we can see that uh, we have only selected west that's uh, showing one two three four two one one three and eight seven nine so when we'll start uh, checking other then it will show the summation of all the values so to hide this either you can uh, hide hide this uh, column or you can uh, change the color of uh, text now we can see that uh, there is no like uh, uh, text box is showing over here uh, no text is showing over here and uh, only checkbox are available so this is on our selection and this selection it starts showing the summation 
so this is very very useful trick you can use this in your uh, report and uh, dashboard and it will uh, help you a lot and user will have a control on that report okay thanks for watching please like share subscribe and comment have a good day